In today's video, we'll be talking about sprints, sprinting, and exactly why it is called muscle building cardio and how it's going to be effective for you. So don't go nowhere. Stay right there. Stay put. Right here. <laughs> hey guys, I'm Frank Daniels, and first off, I'd like to offer you an opportunity to download my free report, Nine Core Training Tips That'll Help You Get the Best Rock Solid Core You've Ever Had in Your Life. You can download that by clicking this link right here. Let's talk about some of the challenges of performing cardio aerobics in place of doing sprinting. Now, most people like to do the kind of slow duration cardio, and let me preface this by saying that um, there's a lot of reason to do cardio, but when that's the majority of your training and you don't incorporate strength training and sprinting, um, you're really going to struggle to change your body and have the body that you really want. Um, so cardio in itself can be somewhat catabolic, and you've heard these statements like people can be, uh, they can be flabby skinny, right? So you can lose a lot of weight pretty effectively, but you're really not going to have any muscle tone, and that's not going to be a benefit because you want to be kind of rock solid, you want to be firm. The last thing you want is to be flabby and skinny. That sucks. So we want to make sure we're incorporating um, not only our cardio aerobics, a small piece of that, but a lot more of the strength training and then the muscle building cardio that we call sprinting. Now there are many benefits to sprinting, starting at the top, whereas sprinting has an anabolic effect. So it actually helps you build muscle instead of having a catabolic effect, which sometimes a lot of uh, cardio aerobic activity does where you actually strip your body of muscle in order to be able to perform the task at hand, which is go long for long periods of time. Your body wants to kind of get rid of muscle in order to be able to do that. So sprinting has an anabolic effect. It fires up a lot of fast twitch muscle fibers, which are bigger. They burn more calories, so they really help you shape your body and ultimately uh, increase your metabolism because of muscle. Uh, less muscle, slower metabolism. More muscle, faster metabolism. So it's a very important thing to understand. Uh, sprinting helps you increase your work capacity. What the fuck is work capacity? Something that trainers always say, use, use this word, work capacity. Like, what the hell does that mean to you? It means you're going to be able to do more. You're going to be able to go harder and go longer and burn more calories and change your body over the course of time. So it helps you there. Increases your endurance. Increases the amount of fat burning hormones floating around in your system. So it's going to, once again, help you change your body. And that's what it's all about. It also increases epoch. Or is it epic? Epoch, but it should be epic. Excess post oxygen consumption. So the amount of calories that you burn in the hours after your workout are increased due to the intensity of the work that you do in your workout. Doesn't necessarily happen in cardio aerobics, but it damn sure happens when you run fast and you run hard. Oh, and of course, there's one very important thing. You look like a badass. And that might be the most important factor, the biggest benefit to you. Now, the big challenge is going to be with sprinting that it may not be for everybody right this second. So in other words, it can be very high impact. And if you have any type of joint problems or you're just not in condition, it may not be what you want to do right this moment. Um, but you should be able to work your way up to it. Again, that's barring any type of previous injury or what you've done to your body over the course of a lifetime. If you have questions about those things or you're really struggling, you really want to seek a dedicated professional in your area that's going to be able to help you build your body in a manner where you'll be able to sprint today. If you have questions about that, send them over to me. I'll try to help you out the best I can if you're in my area or I know somebody in my network that will be able to, to help you out. Um, as always, guys, I hope you guys enjoyed this video. If you want to download my free core training report, I'll give you my nine best tips on how you can build the best midsection you've had in your life. Download by clicking right there. And of course, if you really enjoyed this video, head down below, like, leave a comment, tell us exactly what you want to see next time. And of course, subscribe to this channel right here. My name is Frank Daniels. Guys, enjoy sprinting. Enjoy your day. It's exciting stuff. Starting at the top, which um, muscle tissue, which ultimately... think this shit is easy. Increase fat burning hormones. Hormones that help you burn fat. That sucks.